Hello, welcome to what about YouTube channel. My name is Rahul Mishra. Today we are going to learn how we can sort uh, a data table based on the date value. Okay, suppose just consider we have a table, that table, and in that one column is date. Okay, so we need to sort the entire data table based on the uh, date column. Okay, so that's what we are going to see today. So for that we are going to uh, use a very simple VB script. Okay, so let's start the scripting. So let me create the data table first. So I'm using build data table. Okay, so the column name I'm changing to report. Okay, let it be string. And uh, the other column I'm putting it like a date. And uh, data type also I'm putting like a string. Okay. Let me add the values. So report one. Then date I'm going to give it DD M Y Y Y Y format. So let it be like twelve eleven to zero two two. Report two three three ten two two. Report three mm, okay, ten bar zero one bar two zero two three. A report four thirty bar zero two bar two zero two three. A report five. Okay, so this is our data table. We have two columns: the report as well as the date. And in the report, we have added the report name and the date. These are the uh, target date for completing this report. Okay, this can be done like that. And what I need is I need to sort this data table based on the date. Okay, either it can be dividing order or it can be in ascending order. So let me click on OK. Then what we need to do? We need to uh, create a data table variable. So let me put it like dt1. So that is a data table variable. Okay, so that's a data table. Then what we need to do? We need to sort this based on uh, the date column, right? So that what I'm going to do is I'm going to use an assign activity. Okay, and uh, okay here we will be getting to an another. Data table. So let me put it like a out dt one. Okay, that is another data table. And uh, in this data table, we are going to get the uh, sorted uh, data table. Okay, so let me open the filter. So let's write our uh, symbol VB script from okay R. It means row from R in DT1 is our data table dot as enumerable. Okay, then what we need to we need to order. By so we have the field data, right? So we are going to use date time, okay? And then pass exact, then a row of what is the uh, column value? It's row of B, okay? Then dot to string dot string 
because if there is any space in that particular row we are going to trim it using trim command comma and what is the format it's bd mm y y y y y format okay yeah? so that is the current format of our uh, uh, data then comma culture info dot invariant culture okay then dot date and just consider we need to convert that to a descending format okay so just give descending okay then select r dot copy to that tip. okay so i hope you understood so what it is doing is it is uh, instead of using the loop activity we directly put it in the command itself so it will loop through each row in the uh, data table and it will arrange it in descending format and it will copy it to the new data table okay so that's it okay, come on okay so what is your uh, culture info is either not cleared or not in the current scope okay so i think that namespace is not imported so what we can do is go to imports then search for globalization system dot globalize okay so here it is central globalization okay so if we import that in namespace the error will get up the so that's it so we have sorted the data table based on uh, date column in a descending format okay so what i'm going to do is let me use output data table let me use a message box out dt1 and output we are getting to out str1 okay out str1 so let me execute So let me check why we got this error. So the format is DD uh, M by the way format. Yeah. Okay. Then it's DD M by 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 format. Raw data. The date time representation stream is not supported. So now we got the result. Uh, it's like a thirty zero two two zero two three, then ten zero one two zero two three, then twenty three ten two zero two two. So this is a descending order. Right? So first comes the report four, then report three, report two, report five, and report one. Okay. So this is how we can do the descending. Then just consider we need to do the ascending. So how we can do? So let me copy paste the same thing. Let me create a new uh, variable of dt2, okay. And uh, here, what I'm going to do is this setting, okay. Okay. Then what is
this error converted to string okay. so how dt2 should be a data table that's it okay now i am going to print how dt2 okay that's it so let me execute so now the output should be in a SND format. <coughs> okay, so 12, uh, 11, 2022, then 15, 12. Uh, okay, so here you can see the report uh, field also got uh, uh, sorted. Report 1, report 5, 2, 3, 4, based on the date uh, SND order. Okay, so, uh, so this is how you can uh, sort a data table based on date column using a small VB script ok so hope you are clear about this concept and the script if there is any confusion and if, if you uh, want this uh, workflow you can ping me or you can comment in this uh, video I can provide you or I can share you this uh, workflow with you ok so if you find this video useful please like the video please share with your friends and don't forget to subscribe to our channel so thanks for watching the video bye